Hey guys, thanks for coming back to my channel. My name is Ashley and I love doing DIY projects. Today we're gonna make a hanging bookshelf using a crate, some paint, and a few simple tools. Let's get into it. So here's the old book storage in my son's room and as you can see the basket is busting from the seams. It's hard to access. There's nothing on the wall here so I thought it would be a perfect spot to put some hanging bookshelves. To prep the crate, I sanded any jagged edges that I might have seen so it had a nice smooth surface. Next, I wiped it down with a damp cloth to make sure there was no dust left. Next, I gave the entire crate inside and out a nice fresh white coat of paint. My favorite tip is to go to Lowe's and get the Valspar sample paint. It's $3.99 and they have lots of great colors to choose from. My husband clamped a 1x2 to the crate in order to get a straight cut using a jigsaw. We ended up making two cuts on the crate, one on either side of the middle slat in the bottom. We added four keyhole hangers, one on each side of the crate to hang on the wall. I cut down placemats from the dollar store in order for the books not to fall through the slats while they're being stored. We installed the shelves using drywall anchors to make sure they were secure. Thanks for watching guys. Hope you have a great day. Subscribe and like this video if you like it and we'll see you next time. Bye! I'm so pleased with the outcome of these cute little bookshelves and all in all the pricing was affordable too. The crate was $9.99 from Menards, the paint was $3.99 from Lowe's, the keyhole fasteners and drywall anchors were under $3 each from Ace Hardware, the placemat was just a dollar from Dollar Tree, so all around I spent about $26 for these solid wood hanging bookshelves. Hope you enjoyed, have a great day!